Hi and welcome to the Lock50 training video OG how to add keys after changing to a new RFA. Once you log in to the software you can start the diagnostic scan. Lock50 will scan the modules in the vehicle read and DTC codes present and show you in the next screen. Our software is the most easy to use JLR key programming system that requires very little input to operate. We shall demo how to add a new key and remove a lost key from the vehicle's software. The whole process takes only a few minutes. Lock50 Team support via Remote Team Viewer is available also but you can see how simple, either process is. Already Lock50 can add keys in unlocked RFA in under one minute. However we have here a locked RFA vehicle where we shall load the new RFA software into the new RFA that has been fitted. On the right menu select modules and locate the RFA module. Now click on software update and we'll see the software is blank and the VIN is blank on the RFA. When the software parts are checked you can click on continue to download and then yes to begin programming. Don't forget to check out the upcoming demo of the Lock 50 hw 4 c tool that does not require any new RFA and can allow you to make cheaper copy keys via a simpler method releasing on the 25th of July. Once the RFA is programmed we will move to the PEPS Utilities menu to the next stage of programming the keys. This process for flashing can take few minutes to complete and finally the RFA will be rebooted and will be ready to go to the next step. We stock new RFA and keys to use and you can contact our sales team when you're ready to come on board to purchase all that's required to get started in JLR key programming. Lock50 team offer full support on how to use our tools. Scroll to the bottom of the page to see the key programming menu then run immobization. This will take up to 30 seconds. Done. The next step is to clear the PEPS system and remove all old keys in the system that no longer with us and need to be replaced. This can take 30 seconds. Done. Now we are ready to add the one old and one new key and complete the programming by placing the keys on the Lock 50 HW04 device when requested. If you use a non-UWB key when the function UWB PEPS disable has not been used then you will see this error. Now we will add a real original key on the reader to finish the programming. Final stage now and keys ID is written to BCM to finish the job.
Subscribe to see more demos.